What is up you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And we are back with another video. Today I want to talk about like becoming one with who you are. Um and giving yourself grace on certain triggers and who you are and who you've been before. I remember last video I posted was about forgiving yourself. Um, but nobody talks about the growth that comes with that, um, with not just forgiving yourself, but also giving yourself that space of forgiveness and how much it changes you inside. And so many different ways we evolve and change as individuals. And some people are gonna want us to be stuck. Not a lot of people understand what happens on your spiritual journey unless they've been on one themselves. So not a lot of people are gonna understand you. A lot of people are gonna think you're weird. People are not gonna agree with your own decisions or your own beliefs and your own stack, you know, wherever you decide to be. Sometimes it's okay to take that step back because the truth is we're not here for people to understand us. Not everybody needs to understand us. We are here for our own individual journey. We all came here for a purpose, a reason, a destination. Whatever we are here for, I feel like everything happens for a reason. Now this journey is a self journey, an inner journey towards your higher self and your own higher spiritual wisdom and knowledge that you reach when it comes to spiritual healing and evolvement in self. Um, I think that's something that I've, I've had to work through is understanding that not everybody's going to understand me. Not everybody's going to get me or it's not going to be their cup of tea. And that's okay. I'm okay with being misunderstood or being labeled as like, oh, you're crazy. You're crazy because you have not experienced this journey. Once someone starts going down this journey, they start to realize, wow, like this journey is dark. Everybody wants a spiritual journey, but not everybody's prepared for the spiritual journey. Nobody understands what comes with it and how how much you have to sit in your darkness and come out a, light, a lighter being or brighter being. In order to be this bright, you have had to fight your darkness, right? In order to be this bright, you have had to sit in your own darkness and really feel every single thing that you've ever experienced. Um... That's the hardest part about this journey. And then losing the people that you care about most. People start to fall out that you really, really cared about. People that you were friends with for years. They start to leave because you are no longer in the same frequency and the same suffering energy that they're in. That it just, it doesn't feel right anymore. You feel a shift. Like you can no longer tolerate this energy and you feel like you're changing. I think the hardest part about that is that you truly still do care for these people. And now you have to decide, do I wanna stay stuck in my old energy or do I want to evolve in this new energy? Do I wanna stay stuck in this old energy or do I want to evolve in this new energy? I say, move forward, be the best version of yourself if you lose people that were never meant to be in your life in the first place, if they love you, if they understand you, they understand that it's gonna come with who you are becoming. The real people will stay. The real people who are meant to be in your life will stay. There's nothing that can happen, uh, nothing that you can do that can make someone leave whatsoever. What's meant for you will be yours, like I said. Stop chasing, attract, attract what's meant for you. You don't need to chase. You don't need to go and try to run towards what you want. You just need to be in that energy, act in the energy, and it will come as above, so below, as below, so above. As within, so without. The universe provides, and the universe is within us all. I hope you guys have a beautiful day. This is what my YouTube video is going to be like today, and I hope cannot wait to upload another one on Sunday. Like I said, I was going to film ahead of time. Did not do that. I'm slacking, but I'm still putting out a video for y'all. So I'll talk to you guys later. Love y'all. Peace.